Boosie. She's as Boosie. Gaita. Gaita. Delisa Ghost. Delisa Ghost. Three. Say one. Hello, beautifuls. Welcome back to my Chanel. And this today is the first collaboration I'm filming upon my channel with Relish We are two. And now she's gonna eat your baby. Die, Delisa Ghost. Ah. Dead, dead body. No. <laughs> Uh, and with that, my loves, it's time for another Trini and Susanna. How are you doing, love? I'm well, doing wonderful. It's nice to be back. I'm really excited to watch this because we've not done a Trini and Susanna for such a long time, like for ages. So I'm very, very excited to do this again. The last one we watched was actually, I think it was, was it, I want to say Liz Truss. That's not right. That's the transphobic woman in government. Disgusting. <laughs> no, she was Liz and it, they were like breasts. Bre breasts. Yeah, it was, and it I was, was yeah. told that it was meant to be like a fun lol, but actually it seemed a bit more problematic than that. That was not a fun lol in any way, shape or form. She did not seem like she found it funny. But something that I do find funny. Is body oil. Is body oil today. Um, have I got a little treat for you today? Because today's episode features a woman. <laughs> <laughs> a woman whose last name is McManus. I forgot. Is it Michelle McManus? <laughs> it's not Michelle McManus, but I think it's her mum. So I don't really know what we're going to expect to see today, but I'm sure it'll be more fashion nonsense. Mm -hmm. Daytime tweed, tweed evening sh on. Exactly. I was going to, but then I thought, no. And no. Then I, I thought I'd just go myself and no. it for you. Oh, uh, uh, shake your no. pussy. Shake, shake, shake up. Shake. So, my lovelies, we are going to watch, uh, I think it's season two, episode five, Claire McManus. Claire McManus. Claire's accessories. Claire's accessories. Now, I don't have an oil hanger to put in because I've stopped using them. No, but we so can. So, there. Take oh, that. What's, what's happening? happening? Hang on. Good heavens. Claire's can be a girl's best friend. Claire's. Claire's. Or her worst enemy. Did you see her be like... Oh, yeah. She's yeah. watching porn. My stretch boots. Oh, just hide my thick ankles. Dear. And this top covers a multitude of sins. And that's because we've learned what to wear. And what not to wear. Mm. Oh, there, there. disgusting. There, there. She kind of reminds me of a wacky inflatable arm flailing tube man. Yeah. That Trine does. Mm -hmm. I haven't, we haven't seen this in a while, have we? Trini girls! Star girls! Experts. Experts in getting gout. Honest. Honest. Imagine. Honest. Tough. Assault. Assault. Throw your clothes at the wall oh. and then ravage each other. I've never met a lesbian. What, what not to wear? This oh my target. God, can we just pause and say the 90s what has is arrived. This? What is this Look at the car. Mm -hmm. Disgusting. It's 33-year-old British Airways employee Claire McManus. Oh. No, it's not She's just been promoted to an office job. I thought it was to do with Michelle McManus. Oh. She looks more like a baggage handler. A straight. Also, what's wrong with what's wrong with being a baggage? It's, yeah. it's very classist. That's isn't so it? classist. What's wrong with being a baggage handler? Mm -hmm. Trini Woodall and Susanna Constantine. Style journalist. Style. <laughs> we believe in being cruel to be kind. Claire. What does style journalist even mean? Someone who writes about style. Like, I think so. I think they just write about. Fashion. I feel like that's one of those like I've given myself that label because I know I'm like no I'm, no one goes. Do you know what? Well, we're going to call you a style, style journalist. journalist. No, you've just been like, Damn. I am this. Just to make Does style, style journalists even exist anymore? Is that a job title that's been uh, erased like, by social like media? Like fashion influencers now. That's yeah, what surely that's right, right? No. <laughs> Doesn't know it yet, but we've been secretly filming her for the last three weeks. Look at that hairstyle. She's style. a size 18 and tends to hide her body. Who gets a bob that goes up? <laughs> Susanna, apparently. Yeah. Get away in mannish, baggy clothes. Ooh, but she does make an effort. Just look at that painstaking hairstyle. Lots of work, but for such a little. Oh, that is quite that is, a hairstyle is, yeah, of the is, turn is, of the um, millennium, isn't it? No, but what I do find funny though is, is I do think um, in the two thousands, like the Karen haircut was, was a big deal. Was a big deal, like it wasn't. It wasn't because of the Karen haircut. It was actually quite fashionable at the yeah, time. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. And stay and bump it. And bump Lots it. Of work, but for such a little result. Is that glue? Yeah, sniffing glue <laughs> at lunch. <laughs> this is the very suit. 90s. Cost a 35 quid. 35 pounds. How can you buy a suit for 35 pounds? Well, you can easily. Not everyone well, is rich. Uh, not well, everyone is rich. Uh, and you can be earning them 200 pounds. How dare you not buy a suit for four mm. grand? But also, I feel like you couldn't get a suit now for 35 pounds. Do you know what I mean? I mean, Primark, I still think, would have cheap ones. I think they still sell... 35 is still, like, a suit for 35? So. You could probably just about make it, Mike. 
Boy can't boy. just about boy can't just about off. boy can't. Are you taking the pace? Well, you can easily if you don't want it to fit or look flattering, and that's exactly how it is, Suze. I mean, it is mm. like, you know, men have that problem of always wearing a suit. What do they do? Men have that problem of constantly dressing in women's they suits. Do, yeah, yeah. Closets. She's got that eternal problem now. She has to look smart. The eternal problem. She doesn't problem. have to wear a suit. Exactly. She just has to look smart. And so for her... Well, well, who is allowed... She, she would have noticed this yeah, gigantic how, how, camera like, behind the not, sofa. No, because I think they didn't have small cameras it wasn't back like, then. It was always like... <laughs> yeah. Oh, it was like a massive, like, production yeah. camera. Bizarre. Bizarre. He's a bloke. I know, but she looks, looks like one, apart from her pretty face and her long eyes. She, like she doesn't look like a man. She doesn't. She does. No wonder how, Claire how, how that anything how nominated stupid. her for our tough treatment. I've known Claire for six years, and um, to date, I've never oh, seen a leg. Is he, you know? definitely fond of a bargain, and I think that sometimes... Do people even look like this anymore? No. Like, I feel like all these people look so 2000s. I'm yeah. like, I don't see people looking like this anymore. They're all dead. Bargain gets in the way of whether it's a good buy. It doesn't have to be a short skirt, you know, knee length, thigh length. Are you a connoisseur of skirts? Mm, yeah, he is, yeah. Big. The suits. Mike in the week, Martini in, in the, the weekend. weekend. What is that? Transvestite of the bride? I think they're quite manly looking. Well, Claire Style's very tomboyish, very... Sister. Old. Everyone sounds disgusted when they're talking about her. They're like, Claire Style's just gross. So people we haven't seen Go in about both. 20 years, they asked if we were still together. <laughs> I think if she put the effort in... What was that? I have no idea. So people... We went to a do a couple of years ago and we saw people we haven't seen for about 20 years, they asked if we were still together. <laughs> what, because I they think... thought she was a man and... You were a what? I don't. Understand. I don't understand that. I have. We are we. Is Claire a lesbian? And we have. Are they a it? lesbian? Yeah. Is this like a secret thing? Because this was two thousand and two. Oh, but we're gonna have like must, like fucking homophobia now. Trinity. Oh like, my oh, goodness. Don't you want to look good for your scissoring sister? Like, oh, Jake Shears is quaking. Mm. <laughs> I think. I love a good giggly if woman. If she put the effort in. Claire could definitely have the wow factor. Why don't you put the effort in? The Claire's X factor. The looks, she is Susan Boyle. Mm. But the weird thing is. Her tits are nearly giving her black eyes, but yeah. the hair God, is... You know, now, the weird you thing know, is, you know her tits are mm. nearly giving yeah. her black eyes. She is being battered, black, black and blue. blue, by her tits. Yeah. She is Cthulhu you of know, the breast world. You know, as soon as they meet her, they're going to be like... Ah. Mummy's got breasts. Well, Grotesque. To her head. It Grotesque. Isn't moving. She's Jessica. obsessed with gelling it down, isn't she? But the yeah. rest of her body, it's not flabby. It's really well toned. Yeah. Girl puffer jackets and big tits don't go together. Yeah, do you think they're together? I'm gonna say they were together. That does look a bit Just like that, doesn't it? Potentially. Mm. Are we? Have we become lesbian investigators? We are. Oh, oh, is she or isn't she? Does she drink from the furry? I cup? knew you were gonna say that. <laughs> I'll get cancelled. Not you. It's fine. Yeah. My sister's a lesbian. I'm gonna say it. That is a Michelin man walking around a shopping centre. <gasps> so How and rude! There's a great figure under there, and it's just lost. So what does Claire think? One of you don't need to dress as an icon to go to your local mall. Can you imagine being like, I mean, you do, but you don't. <laughs> don't let anyone ever tell you you're not pretty. You're not, but don't let them tell you. <laughs> Our team posed as a market researcher. I mean, what about kind of clothes that you wear? What do you wear? I really like anything, anything I can God, see. the audio. Mm. She likes anything and she buys She's it. out for pulling a man, isn't she? Yeah, but my God, she's wearing the wrong clothes. Is she? A high-necked, <laughs> sleeveless top. Could not be worth. Does that mean we're not getting Sorry. a lesbian fantasy? Are we not getting a lesbian fantasy? I thought, I want my money back. What's so frustrating is that there is a woman under there. But for some reading, reason, she's wanting to hide it. I know, but the oh. woman that she reveals underneath that jacket is not the right woman either. No. Oh, so what? when she does... So they're, yeah, like, they're, like, they're like, there's a woman underneath. underneath. And then when she does reveal the woman, they're like, no, and but that's, that's not, that's the, right not the That's not no. the right woman. No. She's dead now. One extreme to the other. It's from big butch man to... Show it, spilling it all out. Mm. She is not a big butch man to spilling it all out. <laughs> this language is so repugnant. It is, it is so, it is very... It's troubling. Like, mm. how did anyone at the BBC go, I'm not listening yeah. to anyone. I do find it funny, though, how Trini does have some sort of foresight into fashion, because this is exactly how the emo boys dressed in 2009. Mm -hmm. Dear diary, mood, apathetic. I think she's got so much potential, Suze, but we just need to give her more faith in herself. Mm -hmm. It's all about a state of mind. If she, she believes she can be beautiful, she'll look beautiful. Mm -hmm. I, I but just... at the moment, we just got to get her... If she believes she's beautiful, she'll look beautiful. Yeah. But she is being beaten to death by her own breasts yeah. because she is a gigantic man Victor with a man. woman underneath. Yeah. Away from being a man.
one step away from being a man. Well. I mean, if that's how easy transitioning is, Jesus. Yeah. The NHS is shaking. <laughs> <laughs> Without crying and shaking. Uh. Oh, oh it's a different car. car. This check for two thousand. Two thousand pounds. Before she gets it, she's got. To but she won't be allowed to buy stuff Who she wants. Who wears scarves in their car? Who wears their outdoor jackets and scarves in their car? Doesn't look like it's cold either. I would be. Also, why has she got so much nonsense in the back? Yeah. As if this is. Sort your life out. Sort your, your life out, out, Trini. Go. You're a mess, woman. Oh, it's a very 2000s roundabout. Quiet drink with her best friend, unaware of her the best Oh, best, best friend. friend. No, yeah. Best friend. This is like, they were found next to each other, dead for eight million years. They must have been roommates. Very good friends, mm. yeah. No. They professed each, their love for each other through poetry for yeah. years, saying, please raw dog me on the balcony. <laughs> yeah. They must have been very good friends. Yes. No! God! No, God, please, no! No! But she's doing a classic on her big one. She's having everything on her tent. She's got a good big one. She's a good one. She's a Sorry, what is this place they've stepped into? Bringing the outside in. Bring the Lawrence Wendell Bow and Crown crying and shaking. Say that ten times. Claire? Claire, we've come to well, grab your breast. You're in the middle of a pub Claire, as well. we're Trini and Susanna. Hi. From what not to wear. And you don't know this, Claire. Claire, we have been secretly... She was going to escape there. Yes, she was. <laughs> you can. <laughs> had a few bottles of beer the other night, didn't you, on Friday? You had some we were beer there on filming Friday. You. Claire, do you remember going out for a birthday treat at the Harvester with some mates? My family, yeah. Yeah, we were there too. <laughs> no. And Claire, you're rather partial to lounging around on your sofa in a pair of red pajamas. Exposed. Do you know? I hate like the let's try to like publicly humiliate. It's public someone. humiliation, isn't I just, it? I just find it so rotten. Like I just don't get it. Like you could have easily just been like, oh yeah, we're here to get him. You, you could have got her when she was going to the car, or got her when she's gone somewhere else. But you're like, yeah. we're gonna go and like public a public humiliation, full, a full pub, pub, Lick. pub, public Lick. humiliation. Just Disgusting! Uh, it's very uh, make someone on Tumblr in 2012. <laughs> <laughs> Public humiliation. Stamen! The red pajamas. <laughs> Aren't you? Do you know how we know? Because we've been in your house. Because we've been in you. We've been in you. Claire. We are. I mean, at this point, yeah. yeah. Claire, you've been set up. They're so oh, dirty. So cool. Like, look how like sandwiched between two corpses this is. Mm -hmm. Claire, it's not all painful because this is a check for two thousand pounds. Everyone in the pub loses their mind. Everyone in the pub found crying and shaking. Yeah, <laughs> just literally. <laughs> <laughs> You've got to hand over your body, your soul, and your wardrobe and be ready for a radical... And your vagina! Yes, and your labia majora. It's not my wardrobe. <laughs> Claire, how are you feeling? Um, Do you need a drink? Yes. Yeah. Something stronger, maybe. Can I just get oh, that oh, Let's get around. Oh, she's yeah. crying. Oh. Oh. And they're putting her, their fingers in her eye. Right in the octave nerve. What's happened to me tonight? I'm very nervous, very shaky. Oh, I'm crying and shaking. Totally, totally embarrassed. Yeah. I can't believe Public humiliation. my friends have done this to me. Mm -hmm. And my sister, of all people. It's I've weird that in every episode they keep this in as if this is like, yes, this is justified. Exactly. It's, it's, yeah. it's actually like, no, this person is admitting that you've just traumatised them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Exactly. And they're like, yeah. They're like, yeah, yeah. put it in, yeah. yeah. Do a little rewind. Yeah. yeah. This will make you calm. Good heavens. I've had a look at my itinerary. I'm very excited. I've probably said that about 500 times. Are you dying over the top of the Oh my god, I Death. just can't explain it. Do you need a moment? <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> and pray that Susanna and Trini are not as brutal with me as they are with some of them on the table. Oh, well, no, yeah. Five days later, Claire comes to view the secret footage for herself. How are you feeling? Fine, thank you. Not too nervous? A bit nervous. Yeah, your hands This is me really, nervous, like, she's like, I'm hammy. gonna die. Mm. Yes. <laughs> Oh, Those so, showers are disgusting. Are we ready? Oh, aren't they? Wear a gazebo. It looks like a stick of rock. <laughs> I just want you to talk me through the suit. Talk me through the suit? It's not one of my favourites, no, but... How does it feel seeing yourself on film? Very embarrassing. 
Why? I forget actually. Most most like regular people would not have seen themselves on camera in this day yeah, and age. I mean, most people don't nowadays still. Mm -hmm. How strange. <laughs> I think from behind Claire in that suit, because it was a kind of masculine cut, you've got short hair, your figure was completely shrouded. I don't like shrouded. You showing didn't my look like off. a woman, <laughs> you know, and you have got a wonderful figure and you we need to really encourage you to show it off because there it was totally shrouded. If she doesn't want to show no, her figure off. Emphasis on being like you have to you get wear your entire skin tight out. things, yeah. I'd like to get rid of that suit now. <laughs> don't worry, that will Definitely. be happening for sure. <laughs> Definitely. <laughs> 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 She's not doing Are it right. Are you wearing glasses no. to protect your eyes from getting I two black eyes be. from your boobs? <laughs> black eyes from... Hello everyone, Editing Luxaria here. For some reason, we didn't stop and explain why we reacted like this. So this is a dance mat, also known as DDR, and it is a severely intense passion of both Roly's and mine. And that's why we reacted like this, because never, ever, ever do you see something like this on TV anymore. DDR girls, who plays it, who loves it, leave it in the comments. They made her do that on purpose. Yeah, so like, why don't you get on the dance mat yeah. and jiggle so we can make a comment about your black eyes. My buddies don't jiggle, jiggle. It's, it's, it's oh, that's rude. I could not believe it. You horrible, horrible girl. I Two think black I eyes and your boobs. <laughs> black eyes and bruised knees. <laughs> Oh, there's sticker rock trousers. That's not oh. the right bra, is it? Sorry, are we in hell? <laughs> Why is it so? Why is it like dark? Oh, see, this is unacceptable. And that's unnecessary. That's unacceptable. Where do you get your underwear from, mainly? Marxist. And have you ever been fitted there for a proper bra? Yeah. That's mm -hmm. unacceptable. Was the lady blind who fitted you? I think she must have been. <laughs> that's, I can't, like, like that's so awful. Is We've on filmed you in your underwear you without your consent. You so much time with your hair. If you did, if you did that to anyone now, you could clearly... Prison. Just, you, you would Prison. get arrested Prison. for, like... You take so much time with your hair, okay? And then you prance around like a builder. You prance around in here like you think you know about fashion, you... <laughs> what is that? Transvestite of the bride? Well, let's talk more about the hair. There is no softness about was, it. Wasn't, wasn't she just like... You do too much to your hair. Yeah. Let's talk about your Let's hair. Let's talk about your hair, yeah. Stupid bitch. Do you like it? No. Mm. Disgusting. Okay. It's very hard. It looks, no. I mean, it is totally rigid. It's like you're wearing, you're off to war and you're wearing a tin helmet. Yeah, there's a lot of wax in yeah. there. You're off to, to war, war and you're, you're wearing, wearing a tin, tin helmet. helmet. Dorothy, come, like crying and shaking. You you from the back. I'm sorry, you but you don't, when you, you don't see it like that when no, you're wearing you it. Oh. You don't. But it's like, you're, you know, you're very pretty. And you're obviously, you're confident. You're very pretty, but you are looking like a man yeah. and you're disgusting and you've got black eyes from your the tits. The Michelin man! And you're also just foul and disgusting yeah. and your hair looks like a tin man hat. Yeah. Here up. And then there down. It's doesn't belong to me, it's somebody else's. Do you agree with what she's saying? Yeah. No, she sounds has really it, like I mean, she has yeah. a dysmorphia clothing. issue. And I can't see outside of I think that, that is very much the case. I think yeah. you've you've got this box. They're not therapists. They're, they're trying not. to act like they're therapists. Yeah, you're you're not even style journalists. No, you were sacked. You know, and I feel that closing in on you, and I want to just break it down. And just you know, you're going along in life. That's what you do wear. Again, it's one of these things. You can't break someone down to build them up. Yeah. You've just broken a human mm -hmm. being. Pair of big knickers and a probably an bra that's not fitting properly and. You just look. I do wonder what they ask them in these these like sections. Like, how did it make you feel yeah. to realise that your bra is shit? Can you just say this one more time and have a bit of a tear? Yeah. Can you say it louder? Can you just say anything? Delete girls. Why aren't you making it to the package? Uh, if I just remove. Oh, here we go. Oh, those trousers are hideous. We'll say something else. I'll agree with that. I've got to say, it is very dark. Just looking at it, it's. What's wrong with the dark wardrobe? Mm. Gothic women cried, found um, crying and shaking. Dead. Yeah, we got some real. Look at that! But they're both wearing the same belt. Skirties. Two for one. one two for one. Do you wear them? In Argos. I've worn it once. You've worn it once. And do, do you feel comfortable in it? I felt very on show. Yeah, very on show. Very on okay. show. Mm. To be quite Bye, frank. Bye, Instagram. I, you and I, although I'm thinner and a bit taller, 
You and I basically. She had to. I'm. Oh, you know, I'm actually more beautiful I'm, than you. You are I a bog witch. Figure. I could wear this, I and you are say scum. Can't. Me, me. Let's say something. Measles. I what? have measles. <laughs> I have measles. And you have shingles. You have the plague. Yeah. It's like that, and show off my arms because I know they are not the best part of my body. No. My tits are good. As are yours. Ah, uh, see, so don't another breast touch. Touch. touch people. Yeah, like you, I breast, breast, breast. Look, <laughs> Sarah is one of the closest people in my life, and I would never just, just be like grab her breast, boobs. Breast, like, I would breast. never. I've seen her tits, and I think they're great, but I would never just go up to her and go like breast. I, I just wouldn't do it. No, it's and unacceptable. So, so the idea that total strangers just like. Tits. On TV as well. But it's got to be that power dynamic. We've said it before because at this point, like, you kind of would feel obliged to go along with everything that's happening because yeah. you'd be there. There's a whole film set behind you, sound people, interns, production people, these two presenters. Of course, you'd be a bit like, mm -hmm. okay, like, it's fine. Mind, I yeah. don't mind. Yeah, just touch it again. I don't mind. You know, I'm just going to go to this. What is she doing? Why should be You know what it is? It's like... Stage version of My Fair Lady and the guy who's the dad of, of, of Eliza. I don't know the reference. What, Coleman's? Sorry, I don't, Coleman's. Coleman's. I don't know. Oh, why do you like it? It's a leather jacket. That's leather why I like okay. it. But as it is, sorry, leather or not, it's got to go. Yes. Why? Okay. How do you feel? Do you know what's funny is I feel like what they're saying is what they really want to say is you look dikey, but actually what they're saying is you just look like a man. I think yeah. that's what they're trying to say. Yeah, yeah. it does feel very phobic, yeah. doesn't it? Probably the most expensive thing in my it wardrobe. Is, isn't it? Okay, all right. I mean, I got to say, it looks better on the hanger than on you. I'm sorry, it does. Imagine saying I that. I think to the someone. worst thing about it wasn't actually the jacket. It was you. The trousers. Yeah, it was you. The bagginess of the trousers. I know. They were really mm. because oh, that. They are quite baggy though, aren't you they? You might feel I've got to. I feel like whole... fitted suits weren't a thing in this day though. It was just I like wear a suit, good luck. Yeah, yeah. No, I agree. You I can agree. really tell as well from like how style has evolved. The shape of glasses, like glasses, used to be just these, these massive, huge, like yeah. thick things, like pure satellite fun. dish, pure function, no style at all. And I feel like suits were very that because it was like. Oh, you have to appear a professional, so professionals are like baggy. Yeah. Baggy old bags. I've got a baggy of piss, sweetie. Ass, because I think it's big, but when you have got a larger bum oh, and she's you cover dead. the whole <laughs> ass, it looks even bigger. You have got a bum that goes oh, out go. this way, not that goes out yeah. at the sides. You need skirts that cup you under the ass. Right. Okay, so you, you really didn't show your bum. Oh, so you don't need to cup her. You just don't need to like grab her and do you can just yeah. just you tell can just her. yeah, say. So we really define what shapes suit you and what don't. Mm. This, this is into the chamber right, of horrors, okay. This is where you see it. Disco, 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 ha, 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 ha
hideous. hideous. You can you the, the trousers and the jacket is identical. Like you like I've never what's seen... part of the leg and what's, what's the part? jacket? Yeah. Like where's my breasts? I don't understand why there's just so much grayish in this mm. outfit. Even if, if you kind of blur your eyes a bit, it kind of looks like Trini is actually just part of the outfit. It is. No, it does. She's They're like, like leaning yeah. over. You can wear me if you oh. want. That. Two tickets to the show, please. <laughs> this joke would have landed if I had have said one ticket to the show, please, because she resembles two children in a trench coat. <laughs> Suit. We want you to spend loads of money on a suit, but it needn't be based on a boring man suit in boring Savile Row but colours. That is great. That's also not a suit. Something like this, it could turn out to be. You take off the jacket. You've got something which is still great for work. It's got so textured that's going to draw attention to all the areas that she's been like. I don't sleeves, like it. So it's not too much on the show. But it's also not a suit. You can take an extra pair of shoes with you to work. So when you want to go out, that's, there's not even a blazer. Like your mules. Oh, hideous. A textured pointed witch heel. Ooh. Cackles Here, Academy. The skirt, not A line quite and not totally straight. So something a little bit in between. Mm. Very flat fronted. A bit in between for the you, top, you know. Most yeah. Thing it's very, yeah, it's, it's very like light fabric. Mermaid. So it folds yeah. across your stomach. So you don't know if we're seeing a bit of wobbly, cheeky, naughty fat or whether it's actually. Naughty you don't fat. know if no. you're seeing a bit of wobbly, cheeky fat. How about you give her something that actually fits her instead of like giving her something that's way too small and being like, well, yeah. it kind of looks like you can hide the fat. Like, yeah. just give, make, give, give her something that fits her body. All they've gone on about is you've not got a suit that fits your body. And then she's gone, this is a bit small for you, but you know, these ridges yeah, might hide yeah, some yeah, of the back. Yeah. Like, you won't know what's what. Stupid. They don't know fashion. They, they don't, don't know don't, fashion. They don't. In an ideal world, everyone would like to look like they do, you know. No, no. nobody wants to look like Trini and Susanna. It's the couch. Just, it's, it's not reality. First shopping, shopping day. We'll see. Pussy. Pussy. <laughs> Pussy. <laughs> Pussy. What did she actually say? Pussy. Pussy. Does she say Pussy? Pussy. 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 I really do feel like the Incredible Hulk in it. Help. Oh my god! Why did they include that? I don't know. Beige. 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 Well, I've been in there for about two hours. Tried on about 50 million things. Come out with about five things. And then she says, Look at the size of that shoe. And it's bigger than her. her. And be like, That's this disgusting. Is disgusting. Take it off. Well, you haven't learned anything. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> they will. They'll chase after her they with will. their little thing. They want me to be a little bit more feminine, so feminine. I'm going to give you a healed clog. Thank you. 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 Oh, he's very lad it to lady. It is, yeah. Marks out ten. It's got no orange juice. A say schooner of orange. Um, I still don't think they understand how frustrating it is to buy clothes for someone who's a little bit bigger than they are. We think Claire doesn't trust Thank us you. to dress her properly because we're both different shapes from her, but she's wrong. She's only no, she's right. No, she's right. So You've just far. tried to... So we've come along to keep an eye on her, loosen her up and... Loosen, loosen her up? Loose, yeah. Oh, God. Make those bodily functions go... She's got the silicone. She's today. Yeah, I agree. But her hair is still small. Oh, there comes hair, back the Game Boy Advance yeah. SP. Well, mm -hmm. I'm in Gap. Still don't Gay and proud. Gap. Susanna and Trini are quite up on my size or my shape, so... I'm going to go and confront her on that, because I think she doesn't realise yeah, that we've dressed people twice her size in the past. And they've hated everything. Yeah, and then they've ignored you and blocked you on Twitter. Are they going to have a clue? Mm -hmm. And it's just, we've got to break down that barrier, but yeah. we've got to do it in a very gentle way, because she does have an issue, remember, about her figure. I know she does. No, I know she does. I know, yeah, she does. And, and we're going to ignore that. I want her to <laughs> see that through us, she can feel great about herself. And Lies. I want her to get that face there. Lies Manelli. OK. Right. So okay. why don't we just go call her fat a few more? Yeah, exactly that. These are some... What are you doing? Look, Look she said she could get those done up. It's spilling over. It's, it's not good. It's not good. 
It's not good. It's spilling over. So with spilling. her hair as it, it is, it's not great. But you see, opening it up more, it already yeah, she, is feminine. She needs another button undone. She's mm. not unbuttoning enough. She needs to put that. That's she's only got like three buttons. She needs to. She needs to go naked. She, she, she needs to go naked. Naked, yes. I'm pleased. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I was surprised. I didn't think that I would be able to get anything on in here, but I've been proved wrong. But only a little bit. You know what, Susan? I think she's losing her faith. She's in, losing in the plot. Yes, she is, and I think we've got to go now and take and beat her. Yeah, we've got to go and beat her to death now. <laughs> the choice for her. Wait a minute. I want you to look at Susanna. What did Trini say to a woman a few episodes ago? And you <gasps> oh my God! With black and colour. You. you <laughs> They've also just sucked the blood of a baby. They have, yes. From Starbucks. From Starbucks. We should we go get Starbucks after this? Yeah, why not, Gail? <laughs> Where she feels that there is the choice for her. What are you doing? What are you doing? Stop doing that immediately. Out. Foot locker. Struggling. Oh, it's like Oxford you. Street. Oh, it is Oxford the Street. The idea of this suit. Okay, it's the very idea. clean. Oh. And this may be something you haven't thought about wearing in the evening. And I know it's why. Maybe it's something you haven't thought about wearing. In the, in the evening. evening chiffon. Daytime tweed with an evening chiffon. And I know it's white, but I'd still like to try it to see look the, at shape, her, like, the shape. <laughs> You're gonna yes, look disgusting. I was right, I was right, oh, I was right, I was right. Those trousers it's are white. still it's huge. White. Didn't they say like They're oversized? Yeah. What are you talking about? Yeah, they were like, and look they're too so baggy. And too baggy girls. I don't give you picked out the baggiest trousers I've like, ever seen. Like, look how much MC of her Hammer shoe is, is quaking. Yeah, how much of her shoe is covered? A witch's toe. They are ridiculous. It's white. It's scary to wear, but it is, it, it's gorgeous. It's scary to wear maybe for work. Did and you? I look quite tall in it. Yeah. it makes... Do we know what she does for work? Prostitute. <laughs> Prostitution. <laughs> <laughs> I am very pro sex work. Yeah, me too. Like, well, isn't that fantastic? Yes, it is, but it's not. I, I know that you have you slightly. You've with been that very slurry in this oh, video, haven't you? Treat yourself. I didn't lose my faith in you. I just. Uh, excuse me. We saw you. So just change them. That was like a quick, saying, yeah, a quick change act. They understand. Really a magician. Mm -hmm. They think I'm thinner than I am, and da la la. Are you prepared to trust us on on the star we? No. No. Are you prepared to trust us? No. <laughs> Exposed. Great suit. Mm -hmm. Those really trousers, nice again, suit. are huge. Around, the so shoulder pads, I don't like, but the waist cinch of this. See, I think if they were bigger. Will you stop harassing this woman? Stop grabbing her. It's bigger if they're too big. I love your it's bottoms like, so You need your. I mean, look at that. Just go look, to the side. You are so. There's a time and a place, Susanna. The thing is, they're like fully like. In they're basically inside her. <laughs> I don't, it's really uncomfortable to watch. It's like, so weird. I've never seen anything like this show before. Like even with the other like fashion shows that we've, well, we haven't watched them yet, but I've mm -hmm. got some listed. They don't behave like this. No. Like this is like this so- At least, just say, can I just show you if I just put my hands on you for a second? Yeah. At least ask or something. You don't actually just go up to her and be like, oh, I love I your bum. your bum. And then did you see what she, she like leant against her and like yeah, licked her lips? Her. Literally like, you know, she did, she did tits the first series. It. I mean, I'm a blouse and that's too mm. far. I get a bad reputation. I think they're trying to change me into a young lady. And... I don't know what they're doing, but what they're doing is a mm. sin. <laughs> it's, it's drastic. It's a drastic change. Oh, is that the door that she fell into yeah. several years later and on I... YouTube? Oh, my God. I don't want to disappoint them by walking out of here with nothing, but I really don't. I can't see what's going to happen now. That was a game. Oh, uh, yeah, I saw your eyes move. For a long time, we're wondering if you're just. Say thing felt. Beam down. You were beamed down, Scotty. Yes. Are you a part of the Star Trek team? Is that I what you were thinking? I feel like I'm part of the Star Trek team. That is so kind of dowdy and frumpy. Nice, but this is such a classic thing that a larger woman will go for. And it makes her look bigger. And a mistake that a lot of stores make is just to do a slash neck tunic top, one big mass of tummy and tit. 
Mm-hmm. Is she whispering at her? What is she doing? What a big mess of tummy and tit. Tummy and tit. Tummy and tit. Oh, no. What the fuck is that? I think it's great. Did she just say? I think she's a Spanish senorita. Mm, casual I racism. Think it's oh. great. I do too. I really like it. I wouldn't wear it. I'm sorry. It's hideous. It's absolutely hideous. What is that? Transvestite of the bride? I don't know. Yeah, like because I just, I'm fed up with this. I wouldn't without I just telling us properly. I know. I, I don't know why. There isn't. Well, it's just not. It's not me. It's you know just not it good. Mm. It's not masculine enough. But do you want it's to be masculine, masculine enough? enough. No, Get a no, grip, Trini. You look like the most manly know. one here. Yes. A 28 inch dong in your pocket. <laughs> Mary loves dick. <laughs> you stand out too yeah. much in it. Oh, far too much. Is that the, is that the issue? The thing is, I, th I think this is very telling actually, because like, it would be like if I was to try and to style someone, because they're doing it in their like, this is what we like. If I was to like get Callum and try to put him in my clothes and make him look the way I look, he would hate it because it's not him. Yeah. Like he's not the kind of person that wants like, bright eyes and all these like jewelry and everything and like yeah. that's not him yeah and the same thing for this woman like yeah. she clearly doesn't like these like bold patterns that are like very in your face eye and catching and the thing is when you have bold patterns it makes things look wider mm -hmm. as well and i don't think that's the goal here yeah it's weird i don't i don't get it it's such also, a strange leopard print on leopard print yeah it's a bit much hello hello i am actually a leopard I'm cosplay on the beach no not necessarily i've just it just wouldn't be me. This is an amazing opportunity for you to maybe change a little bit and become somebody else. a bit more exotic and a, with yeah. a hope. A bit more bit exotic. More mm. Oh, that means wearing um, letter print. You know, that's See, the I don't thing. think this would give me confidence. Okay. This would make me shy away. I think we can't. If you're professionals, you'll be like, okay, we'll find something else then we'll do it. Yeah, exactly. If you're that, that good at what you're doing. Do you doing, like the colour? Do you like the pa pattern? Do you like the shape? One, yeah. one thing that you like, wonderful. We'll find something else yeah. that matches that. Yeah. We can't. Anymore. We've done our best and it's, it's anyway. a shame. Okay. It's a shame. We've done our best. <laughs> we clearly haven't, have you? very girly or womanly. Um... Why are we filming her pinch her waist? Mm. I think I'll surprise them. Four days later, Claire returns to... Oh, she's wearing her, like, Oh, she's got a different hairstyle, yeah. did you see? She was like, fuck you. She transforms into a woman. <laughs> what have they done to her hair? What have they done? They were, she had the... She would, oh. They already Look, said to her that her hair was already too short. Too much, too short, too much, took too much time, blah de blah de blah and But also, look at her neck shape here. I don't like this hairstyle, I'm just gonna put this out there, but it fits with her neck shape and with the size of her face. Mm. They've made it shorter and her neck now, like, where have her ears gone? She looks mm. like a thumb now. Can you can tell they're just like, I love, yeah. it's, it's a joke. Yeah. <laughs> mm. She hates it. Mm -hmm. Very different. She Very different. She hates it. Also, you, like, why yeah. is she giving this a disgusting, yeah. like, green Much khaki better. kind of... Is just that khaki? Is that what it's yeah, I think so. And just think, God, I want to snog that woman. Because you look so different, and you look so amazing, and you're standing there, very calm, cool, and collected. And I yeah, want much to older. And I down and scream because you look so amazing. <laughs> no, it's... I, it's totally different. It looks really she, nice. You can see she it. Hates she hates it. it. Also, Susan is wearing colour and black again. Yeah. You're a mess, woman. Lies her interior. Because I know inside you're going to... <laughs> brain working over time. <sighs> wow. The contrast between you now and the buffer woman. <laughs> The woman. It's the wolf. What woman, the babba woman. The babadook. The babadook. Between how, you and the babadook. How did they honestly get a show and this is what their result? This is this is their fun. It's like this. Everything she's wearing there is the most basic kind of basic, and it's also unshapely. Look how big that makes her shoulders, and mm -hmm. then keep saying, "You look like a man. You look like a man. We're gonna cut your hair shorter and make your shoulders even bigger. You look like a man." Stupid. What are you doing? How do you feel in it? Very comfortable. Yeah. You were a puffer mouse. And now you're this, and you feel happy like that, and happy to walk down the street, and proud of yourself. Per se. So <laughs> per se. Ooh. Ooh. My boot, Wellington boot, Wellington boot. Ooh. Ooh. I mean, I think that she is makes just like truly gorgeous. gorgeous. I don't know. And the fishnets are just a sneak of a new you. I mean, how would the boys react at work seeing fishnets? 
they'd just laugh at me anyway. <laughs> well, no, well, no, not laugh. I don't mean laugh. Like, I mean, like, because it's, 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 to me, I find it very strange. There's like a little gap here with the knee. Like, yeah. either make it so like it's the you can see bone it, yeah. or nothing. The it's bone. Weird, the, 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 strip back the skin and put a fishnet over the bone. Thank you very much. That's much better. I think what the bottom half of the leg was called was like shin. The shin. I was like, show like the whole shin have like a smaller boot and then have the fish next there all like absolutely or a shorter skirt yeah it's weird that it have a just a tiny oh, bit an it, inference of nonsense it, she's so cool suave yeah. and select she's gonna take suave. her time what about, about this what, outfit it says suave about standing out claire you're getting used to it yeah aren't you i <laughs> no, no, no she hates yeah. it but that's great. We love it. At this point, it's like sunk cost fallacy for Trini and Susanna. They're mm -hmm. kind of like, you do like it, do you just getting used you to it? You, you love can... it. And they're like trying to like push that narrative of like, you do. Being in this industry we've been in for a long time, I know, and going through a lot of process when it comes to like TV shows, I know about how the manipulation can happen. And yeah. I swear to you, they probably were backstage with the production team going, you need to liven up a bit. Yeah, liven Say up a like bit it. and be like, oh, don't you look great? Why don't yeah. you go out there and tell them how much you love that? Yeah, yeah, just that, yeah, 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 yeah. And it's like, you can see through it. As yeah. soon as you know a little bit about the industry, it's completely see through. Yeah. 10 out of 10. Good, good. Oh, God. She said she hated this. I love it's disgusting. It. I cannot tell you how. There's even like fringe, look at the fringe oh bits on like the God. I didn't even notice that the first time. So not only are you making everything look wider, you're also taking up extra room from the flounce. This is not flattering on her body at all. No. It does. And these little bits look like piss stains. Yeah. Like the dark bits. I'm like, why is it like random like She's been in the shower in the in dark room? room. Yeah. I love it. I'm so, it's disgusting. I cannot tell you how happy I am you bought it. How do you feel in it? Like Disgusting. A, girl, a lady. A lady. A woman. It is like a woman. A woman's ankle. She hates it. She really hated she it. She literally said a minute ago how much she disliked it. She yeah. Did. And now she's saying, I feel really like a woman. You yeah. know that they. That you could, they fed so, her those lines. It is so see through. They clearly were like, do it. Yeah. Say it for us Say or it. we'll beat Say you. It. <laughs> Say it or we'll lock you in the cupboard and feed you pins. You lock me in the cellar and feed me pins. <laughs> And you will be noticed. Yeah. And you will have to. You will be do noticed it. in that outfit, but not for a good reason. You'll be noticed by some gorgeous, single, hunky man who's just going to want to rip it off. And that's what this dress is. Did you is see how unenthused her face was? <laughs> oh. Claire, come and sit down. She doesn't want to be with a man. I don't Claire think. Claire will have the boys queuing up with this sexy new that wardrobe. That is awful. That is disgusting. The boys will never queue up for this towel. How did they have a show? Dress as sea foam. <laughs> Even her casual clothes are feminine. <laughs> this is my favourite. The cut and colour do so much for her. Debenhams. Claire followed the rules completely with her shoes. I quite fancy some of them myself. That's disgusting. And that denim suit, what an improvement. I don't on mind the, the, the colour of that. Mm -hmm. But the shoulders oh, were way too big for this her. Leopard print dress. Wait, that sums up the new sexy feminine Claire. Fuck me! And she's even bought this negligee for some late night entertaining. The saucy devil. Why would you expose her like that on the BBC? Whilst we return to she's our day jobs of correcting the nation's fashion faux pas, Claire returns. Who is she on the phone to? Me. She's phoning the nation. Yeah, no, she's phoning me. Follow her. Hello. Just been wearing pink and blue. That's a great suit. Looks like a new bag as well. It's nice yeah. to know she's been shopping. That's one of the. Oh, oh my oh, god! The shoes That's match brilliant. the That's trousers that Trini was wearing. Yeah. What a difference! Does the spaghetti match the drapes? No, is the well, yes. Not that. Oh, oh look, it's her dress mm. on the sofa. It's yeah. the right. Look. It's her dress right there. Oh yeah, gorgeous. Thanks. Not that. that horrible awful thirty-five soon. pounder. <laughs> She's now like, um, out of all that casual stuff, she's now wearing like quality clothing and she's just like, looks so radiant. Yeah, I mean, and I think like uh, the programme has managed to bring out the beauty in Claire as well. Thank you for your contribution. Yes. Great, basically. It's very fashionable, it's very in, it's very new. Compared it's very to in, it's very out, out, it's very like up, it's very down. You know, I, I nominate... You know, I am a lesbian. <laughs> she looked common and she doesn't know any of those things anymore. I'm really blown away 
That's why I've asked for her hand in marriage. The transformation is so immense. Uh, she looks so confident, Susanna, yeah. and I think that's. I suit actually don't mind the white jacket there. I think that fits better than the other jacket. Woman. Yeah. But don't those bloody well, trousers. Okay, mm -hmm. This evening, I gasped in amazement. I just couldn't believe the transformation I saw in it. Transformation. It's like a completely new woman. Hopefully, in a year's time, she'll still be going out buying that sort of clothes and really sort of taking care. You so know, I can rail her down by the dock. Yes. Yeah. And um, probably getting checked senseless. I thought we said as well as like wedding photos. <laughs> yeah, literally, yeah, she's getting married. <laughs> Clearly, none of these people are no. lesbians, and we're like lesbian fantasy. Yeah, yeah. more lesbian representation, please. She is the centre of attention. Really funny. She's, yeah. Because she's become a woman. She's not a lad. For God's sake. For God. Is she just about to say she's not a man anymore? Anymore. <laughs> <laughs> what are you talking about? Because she's become a woman. She's not a lad anymore. A lad. God's sake! Oh, it was awful. Was the like, transphobia what's and funny? just the general insults. Ridiculous. What's funny is like, it's like leopard print and then there's a tiger next to her. Yeah, oh yeah, we're oh, going on a safari. safari. She, she loves it. Yeah, it's she loves it. Dress, and she's enjoying being I don't like that necklace, attention. like literally going into it's the like, cleavage. Look. Oh, here we go. It's Sexy made poses. me more oh, of, a death. of what to buy. It's making me think. I have no idea and what so the end of this is. Why is the every end different? I have to think about what I'm picking up. Did they literally get her like three outfits and spend two grand? Mm -hmm. Well, goodbye. Hideous. So, I've got some thoughts about what we've just watched today. I still, I think I say this every single time, but I can't get over how touchy-feely they are. Mm -hmm. And particularly with her bottom in this yeah. one. It seems that neither of them really understand the concept of buying trousers that fit. Yes, I, I, after having that embraitment of her at the beginning there. There's two big Your yes. trousers are disgusting, yes. girls! Your bum looks disgusting! And then all of a sudden they're like, we're gonna give you the exact same thing. But in white, in white. so that everyone can see it and it looks yes. even bigger. This leopard print monstrosity <laughs> as well. That was, I cannot believe that was over 300 it, I don't understand why they're so stubborn. They're they like, are. No, you have to have this. And it's like, there's no give or movement about what the person and wants. And this is why I say about the whole professionalism, about that. they're obviously not very good because they're not giving a, actually like a wide choice to say, we want this. No, if you don't like it, tough. Like, it, again, if you were a professional and you knew what you were you talking about. You know how to adjust. You would instantly be like, okay, we'll find something, we've got this. Well, how do you try this? Like, yeah. they obviously Do you like the no colour? Idea. Wonderful. We'll put yeah. something else in the same colour yeah. or a similar colour. They have no idea about no. how to do this. So, with that being said, my loves, I think it's time for the Patreons. But beforehand, let me know what you guys think about what we've seen today this monstrosity this fashion nonsense mm -hmm. let me know what you think in the comments box go today's twitch shout out goes to phoenix thank you so much for following me over on twitch you stunning woman on the go she's asleep she is asleep <laughs> and if you would like to follow me over on twitch it is like saria plays and i stream two nights a week monday and thursday and i am back to my regular scheduled Ooh. streaming how dare you i'm gonna i'm gonna set trini on you statement and once again, I want to say a massive thank you to my top tier Patreons, Aloria, Dr. Dreamerella, Stephanie Neotupski, Beebles32, Shell Herman, Christina Kyle, Condra Points, Crafty Leagues, Danielle, Dr. A, Jevod, Elizabeth Stone, Eric Castillo, Jen Martin, Jenny Hendricks, Caitlin Wright, <gasps> Laura Jane, Laura Jane again, Les Banana, Lisa Pennington, Min Min DM, Moisten98, Mariah Sherman, Nixie Tricks, Paola Rivera, Rachel V, Seabiscuit, Romano, Ryan Vita, Sasha Smith, Sexy Texy RN, Slampire Queen, Steph Uquette, <laughs> Travelful, Tromo, Victoria Gorilla, and Thank you guys for being Patreons. If you want to join the Patreon, check the link in the description box below. And you know what, my loves? I think I'm going to leave it on the note of... Um, don't go on the BBC. No. <laughs>